A new leak suggests that the GeForce RTX 3080 is 50% faster than against the 2080, and this would mean that upcoming Ampere is taking a 20% bigger leap in performance than what Pascal did with Turing. And in other words, we're looking at a massive performance leap here. And in today's video, we're gonna talk gaming performance and Nvidia GeForce RTX 3080 and 3090. There has been a massive amount of leaks lately, where a big one has been the reference cooler, along with rumors of specifications and power delivery. And when it comes to performance levels compared to the current RTX 2000 family, there has been leaks suggesting up to 4 times ray tracing performance and 50% a better energy efficiency. Now the Twitter user KCatKorgi tweets that the upcoming RTX 3080 will beat the 2080 Ti by around 20%. Now the same user also presented the specifications that cover the entire GeForce RTX 3000 series and looking at this leak, the user states that the upcoming RTX 3080 matches the flagship T2080 Ti with a number of CUDA cores. Now, while KCAT Koji doesn't mention what the 20% performance increase is based on, I have a strong feeling we're not talking pure ray tracing performance here, but overall IPC increase thanks to double L2 cache and higher core clock. And we believe that the ray tracing performance increase will be much greater. A couple of rumors have been suggesting four times better ray tracing performance. Based Basically suggesting that an RTX 2060 should do ray tracing around the same level as an RTX 2080 Ti, if not even better. But as always guys, as all of this is just speculations, we should all treat this as a rumor. We know that the RTX 2080 Ti is about 25% faster than the 2080 in 4K Ultra HD. This means that the improvement between the 2080 and the 3080 should be around 50%. And if this is true guys, we're looking at a greater performance leap uh, compared to the transition from the GTX 1080 to the 2080, whereas the 2080 is about 40% faster uh, stand against the 1080, and there is about 33% difference between the 1080 Ti and the 2080 Ti. Now keep in mind guys, upcoming RTX 3080 is not the flagship, and so we are expecting massive amount of performance for the top performer, possibly being the 3090. Now it should be said guys, we can only speculate on the performance increase at the current time, and same applies to the performance on the ray tracing front. But yeah, let's talk release date now. Nvidia revealed the Turing family and the RTX card for the first time on August 22nd in 2018 at Gamescom. This means that the second anniversary is approaching pretty fast. Now, prior to the reveal at Gamescom back in 2018, we saw a rise of leaks and information revealed around upcoming Turing cards as we got closer to the actual reveal. And when it comes to upcoming Ampere based cards, yeah, we are seeing a similar pattern here. This means that we aren't far off from a final reveal. This kind of leads is over to release date and what I'm finding interesting is the fact that Gamescom is actually approaching pretty fast and based on previous leaks we do think Nvidia will reveal Ampere at some form of media event sometimes in August or September and Gamescom would therefore be the perfect time to do that. Another leak points out September 17th as the official release date for the 3080 and the 3080 Ti and this also does line up pretty well with other leaks. Now what do you think about the 3080 Ti? In the meantime, watch either of these two videos and I will see you guys in the next video.